Well, let's get more now on the humanitarian situation inside South Sudan. And I'm joined in our studio by Francis Lacas. He is the Deputy Regional Director for the aid agency Oxfam, responsible for the Horn East and Central African region. Mr. Lacas, welcome to Africa Live and thank you for joining us. Now, just give us an assessment of the thank you. humanitarian needs uh, needed there inside Sudan, inside South Sudan. How bad is the current situation? Well, actually, the situation is very tense in most of the part of the country. And as the violence uh, and insecurity spreads, um, the needs of innocent people is um, caught up in, in, this, in this war um, is escalating. So the violence of the human rights abuse and um, must stop immediately. And uh, so uh, we know, for example, that we have at least in five or six states that the violence spread all over. Um, reaching more than 65,000 people who are trying to or are sheltered by UNMIS in the base or sheltered in churches and try to find safety and security. We're talking about 65,000 people now affected though and we're also talking about uh, the conflict spreading to five other states. What is needed? Actually, uh, humanitarian agencies are working on to support those innocent people and, and uh, to support them life-saving uh, activities. So we're trying to provide some clean and safe water, um, good sanitation, um, basic food so they could, they could uh, survive for the, for the next days and while the support is coming in. In, in terms of the humanitarian situation though, what kind of conditions are the people living in? Because a lot of the people now are said to be inside UN camps. What kind of yeah. conditions are there? Well, it, well it, it all depends, but conditions is certainly overcrowded with a lot of people in a very small space um, seeking for protection. Um, and aid agency who are in the position to support them are trying to provide them with some best uh, values for uh, different for water, for example, or for the sanitation, um, could bring a certain danger if this is not taken care of it, it looks in, in the health of the population. And it, it is looking, though, at the moment that uh, the uh, crisis is spreading very fast, the conflict is spreading very fast. In your words, in, you know, in under a week, you've got about five states now affected. Are there any plans by aid agencies, though, like Oxfam, to start moving people out of the camps or out of those regions? Well, currently Oxfam is working in, in mainly in Juba. Um, we relocated our staff in, in that area, and we're trying hard to support all the thousands of people who fled and, and uh, to support them in the needs in, in Juba. Um, the other countries, we're monitoring the situation, what's happening, and we will follow up. The information we have now is the situation in this tense in the areas where we already described uh, in, in, in South Sudan. Well, uh, there are a lot of governments now that are evacuating, uh, both regional and international governments are evacuating uh, their citizens out, out of uh, South Sudan. What would be uh, Oxfam's appeal? Um, Oxfam currently is working in, 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 uh, in Juba. Uh, we relocate our staff to support more people in that area. Um, and we have some support coming in for uh, different sectors of activities. Um, actually, what we're trying to find out is we're trying to support and asking um, in line with the, the, with the UN is to um, reinforcement of support for the UNMIS so we could have surge capacity to support the needs of the people. Uh, we've seen people fleeing uh, I in their hundreds there outside, out of uh, South Sudan. What is the condition, though, of the children, the most vulnerable? Well, like in, in all the crises, uh, children are always one of the key uh, victims of the situation, they're probably the first one who are, uh, need most support. Um, that is kind of standard in, in, in terms of support for humanitarian aid. So children, women, um, uh, overall the protection of you know, the civilians and the human, we're asking to stop also human right abuse in, 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 in this situation. All right, uh, Mr. Francis Lacasse, uh, the Deputy Regional Director for Oxfam BAD Agency. Thank you very much for joining us here on Africa Live.